Right. Hello, parents. Hope all is well. Um, just want to introduce myself for you here. Uh, my name is Mr. Joe Casarella. I'm currently an alumni of the class of 2013, and I'm serving as your child's uh, short-term substitute teacher here for music three and four. Uh, Mr. Raimundo has uh, been on a short-term leave of absence, so I've been taking over his, his spot for the time being. Um, a little bit about this class and what I wanted to bring to this class. Um, through the course description right here, um, students will gain a better appreciation to music as a whole. You know, to many of us, music can mean you know anything to really anybody. Students will also learn notes, major scales, minor scales, chord progressions, along with musical history of a wide range of different genres between rock and roll, hip hop, country, jazz, etc. And they'll gain a better opportunity to learn families of the many different instruments in the orchestra. Um, Students will get appropriate to showcase their personal pleasures in music by creating three projects on their favorite artist, album, and top five songs of all time, which is actually what we're going over right now. Um, currently, students are presenting their projects on who their favorite artist is of all time. Um, some of the topics that will be discussed, we already went through what is music, how music is formed, the power of music. We went through a test on the piano with major and minor chords identifying keys in the piano, the circle of fifths, all that. Um, soon we will be going into the history of rock and roll um, and naming the instruments of the orchestra. Now, these are my breakdowns for uh, their point systems. So test, there's gonna be about three to five of them through the half year course for juniors. Um, seniors, there will be about five. And there's gonna be 100 points for that test. Uh, homework, participation, and their overall work ethic counts for 30 points. Your projects, which are, you know, the foundation of this course and, you know, the big chunk of their grades will be 150 points. And then New Music Fridays, which is something that I implemented um, when we first started that on Fridays, what we do is we go through the New Music release charts and a student, uh, a couple students per class have an opportunity to participate and talk about a new song in which they've heard in the release charts and they write a reflection um, for that song in which they are able to choose. I have to approve it before they're able to present, and that is worth 50 points. A lot of this class is for them to gain a better appreciation to music as a whole. Nothing in which of what I'm trying to do for them uh, is anything hard. Um, my tests and every assignment is open notes, so they can use the notes for their tests as long as they write it down in their notebooks, because um, I want them to do well. Um, this is a class that, you know, I think we have a lot of fun. You know, we, we learn a lot about different types of music and it's, it's really a refresher from their day, um, you know, throughout, you know, everything that's what's going on. This is a time for them to relax and, and really get a taste of all the different types of music that's out there. So um, if you guys have any questions to me, my email is jcasarella, J-C-A-S-A-R-E-L-L-A -L -L at ionaprep.org. Don't hesitate to reach out to me with any questions, comments, or concerns um, about your son's experience here in this class and also with, with this study. So um, with that, if you got this is my syllabus. You guys can see it on uh, Plus Portal when you guys go down. And everything there is pretty self-explanatory. So I uh, hope you all have a good day and hope to hear from you guys soon. Okay.